My husband used to call the industry the industry of broken dreams and disappointed hopes. In 1991, there was nobody in any major orchestra in the world who was a woman. Why didn't they admit women? What was their excuse? Women have periods. Women have babies. 1993, very famously the first time a woman had conducted in the Vienna State Opera. For the first time, I have seen a woman conductor who completely asexualized her gestures. What does being a woman have to do with conducting? My tits don't get in the way. <laughs> I tried for many years to have this career and have a family. You talk to any mother who travels, I mean, we all hate it. Just over three years ago, Simone Young made a return home to become Opera Australia's music director. She walked into a job with many, many limitations. What was shocking about it was how badly she was treated. Being a musician is not just a job being a musician also defines who we are. And suddenly that was all ripped away. I found it devastating. It's a fascinating human story to see this unassuming girl come back to take the most important musical position in the country, having failed once before. I doubt myself every time I step in front of an orchestra, every time I get ready to step out on stage. What is she going to make of it this time?